have to use this little three minute thing that I'm doing over here. Thanks. Okay. Uh, yes, I also uh, support the creation of the Human Rights Commission. Uh, like I said, I, I do a lot of housing advocacy and uh, advocacy around food access in the city, and I think that those are some big issues that are affecting um, particularly African American uh, people in the city of Richmond. You know, there's a high concentration of African Americans in the impoverished areas of the city, and there's like so many different layers of uh, exclusion to those communities that I think that could be uh, investigated by this body, uh, by the, a body that potentially would be created. Um, Virginia, I mean, people may not know this, but Virginia, uh, the only civil action that requires poor people to put down a uh, appeal bond in order to appeal uh, a civil action is for an eviction. That's the only, the only civil action in the state of Virginia that requires poor people to pay three months rent ahead of time in order to appeal. So uh, the general district courts tend to run over poor people in the city of Richmond and they can't afford to appeal it, so they don't even really get a, a real good day in court. So uh, the Virginia Human Rights Act has protections for real estate transactions, so that was why I was particularly interested in it when it came up in November. Uh, I know that the paper was approved in November. Um, this isn't the question time, but I was wondering why uh, it took until March for the task force to begin work. But um, yeah, so I do support the, uh, the creation of the uh, Human Rights Commission. I think it's important that uh, the representation on the, you know, the task force and uh, the commission be uh, paid attention to. I think that um, it's good that a lot of people on the task force are uh, here in like professional capacities. Um, I kind of, uh, I was concerned that a, a lack of uh, uh, awareness of current human rights issues that are current, that, that some of the task force members may be uh, concerned about that are currently going on in the city. I, I heard a lot of uh, programmatic stuff and uh, concerns for the way that the commission would be set up and everything, but I didn't hear like a lot of specific uh, human rights concerns that are currently going on in the city. And I don't know if that may be, you know, uh, well, I just think we need to pay attention to the, the makeup and the representation on the bodies that have to do with uh, the Human Rights Commission. Thank you.